my fellow muggles and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another Harry Potter themed unboxing video. While this video is filmed recently, it's boxes that I've kind of just had lying around that I never ended up touching. We will be going through that. Today is a geek gear box and I know it is November now and the spooky season has passed us but it doesn't mean we need to not have the spook in our life. Am I right? And I'm hoping we get a little bit of that today with this box because today my fellow wizardry people. We will be looking at Geek Gear's Toil and Trouble. Hoping it's a lot of potions. It's going to be Halloween themed. I know I'm late to the party. Get over it. <laughs> and I think I also have something that I bought. Some extras that I bought. I will have a look at the end of the video. Ready? Let us open the box. Oh, just can I just say how pretty is this box? So it's one of the, the limited edition ones as it says right there. Opening it up. Boo! Ooh. I like these. Purple and orange paper filler thing, protector, whatever. I don't know. Oh, oh my God. It looks like an infestation. <laughs> I literally just moved the t-shirt and it goes like this. It's all there. Ugh. Look at it. I've just made so much of a mess. We have a nice little instruction manual, I guess, info information, piece of paper telling us what's in the box. Yep, since we saw the t-shirt first, let's uh, start off with it. And the Scaly Grow Bone Regeneration. Purple does match my lips, so appropriately themed. <laughs> Ladies medium is quite comfortable. Pretty standard quality t-shirt. They're really good, they're like very durable. Next on the list, we have a ghost portrait by Tony Blake. I don't know how I feel about this one. I don't know, I just feel like it's all right, but maybe it'll look better if it's in a frame. Not that I could do anything like this myself. I have no talent, no talent whatsoever. But yeah, I mean, mm, that's cool. Ugh. Oh my god, I just read it. So we have a Wandering with Werewolves notebook, <laughs> but it's um, based off of Gilderoy Lockhart. You know, the best wizard of all time. <laughs> it looks like a legitimate book. It doesn't even look like a notebook. Just inside it's just blank. You need to make your notes. But it looks like a legitimate book. I thought it was a book, I didn't realize <laughs> when I saw it. Oh, I like these. I need some, needed some coasters for my lounge area. So it's a set of four spooky coasters. I already see a Thestral drawing a carriage. Quite interesting, so two are the same and two are different. We have two Skelly Grow looking one potion bottle ones here. Is a Dementor and a Thestral. Very nice. Cork underneath. I definitely needed some crystals, so I'm glad I got those. They actually look quite nice. Always need socks in my life, and I now have some villainous socks. So they have the Dark Lord's mark on them. I shall put them to good use. I think this is a pumpkin juice bottle replica. Ah, I see. That's the bottle. And with a little pumpkin lid, but it doesn't attach itself. And the stickers are kind of just like stuck on there. They're far from perfect, but it's okay. Cute little replica. This one's a mini pumpkin pasties, mini pumpkin pasties mini board. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I see. That's a cute little thing. I really wasn't sure when I saw this box what it was. I'm just like, is this food? <laughs> but no, I'm okay with that. Of course, with any subscription box, we have to have at least one enamel pin. I feel like it's some unspoken law. This one is Follow the Spiders, also got the nice purple theme. And even on the back, the details are R.I.P. Aragog. So I've gone through this, I feel like quickly, but I don't know. I'll find out when I'm editing how long I'm actually taking time. It goes by differently when I'm filming. There's one thing left in the actual box and then I've got a few things on the side that I bought myself. And the last thing is a potions tote bag. We've got all of the different types of potions around the corners. And then it says, bewitch the mind, ensnare the senses. And we all know where that's from. Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. When we meet Severus Snape. Like it's an okay box. It wasn't as exciting as I thought it was going to be for Toil and Trouble. Did you feel like this was Toil and Trouble? I guess you got the pumpkin themed stuff. You've got werewolves. You've got nearly headless Nick. You've got the Thestrals. So there's like a lot of dark elements that do kind of make Halloween. Skelly Skeleton. So I guess, yeah. 
Yeah, it kind of is. It just wasn't what I was expecting it to be. I bought a few things. I'm gonna leave, I think, my favorite one to last. In here, I got some artwork. I liked having like little artworks around the place that were Harry Potter related. And I liked the houses. I was gonna get my own house or like Ravenclaw and Gryffindor, but I did like how the other ones looked, so I did get all four of um, the Hogwarts houses artwork. They got Slytherin, Ravenclaw, these prints are so pretty. Hufflepuff, and of course, Gryffindor. So they're all quite realistic imageries of the Hogwarts houses animals. And last, Lead, which I feel like could come under the theme of Toil and Trouble. I did buy a potion that I did feel like looked really cool. It is Unicorn's Blood. It's just so pretty. I love it. And the cap does come off, so it's not like liquid. It's just probably glitter, blue, striped. Yeah, I love it. Unicorn's Blood. You don't drink Unicorn's Blood because you'll have Half-Life. We all know. So I've added that to my collection of little potions, which I love. I think that's one of my favorite things to get in these boxes is potions because I would have done potions if I was at Hogwarts and I would have been good at it based off that I did biology so hmm. no I would have loved it besides being terrified of Snape if I was there during that time which I wouldn't have been because I was a baby anyway that is all my magical items for today. This is all with Geek Gear. I hope you liked it. Let me know what was your favorite item below. Do you think that this was a toil and trouble box or if it was just mm, Harry Potter box? Thank you for watching. If you're feeling generous, feel free to like, comment below, subscribe, turning on that notification bell so you know when I post every Wednesday, although sometimes I am late with editing. I also have a second channel if you wanna go check that out where I do fitness and kind of dance related videos. Yeah, and I post there every Friday. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you when I see. Mwah!